find the equation of the line through the point 7 negative 1 with slope m equals negative 8 third. Give the equation in standard form ax plus by equals c. So even though it says to give the equation in standard form, I'm actually going to find the equation using point slope form, which is y minus y1 equals m times x minus x1. In order to use that form, I need a point, which in this case is 7, negative 1, which I'm going to label x1, y1, and I need a slope, m. So those are the two pieces of information I need, and I just plug them in. y minus y1 is the y value of the point, which is negative 1, equals m, which was given as negative 8 over 3, times x minus x1, which in this case is x minus 7. So, minus negative, y minus negative 1 actually turns into y plus 1 equals negative 8 over 3 times x minus 7. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to multiply both sides of this equation by 3, the denominator of the fraction. When you multiply both sides of the equation by 3, here's what happened. On the left side, you're multiplying by 3. On the right side, you're multiplying by 3. But the 3's on the right side just cancel each other out. So the very next step looks like this. On the left, you'll still have the 3 times the y plus 1. But on the right, after the 3 cancels, after the 3's cancel, you'll have a negative 8 and an x minus 7. And from here, you can proceed to put it in the correct form. So we have our equation. Let's go ahead and put it in standard form, ax plus by equals c. To do that, we need to get rid of the parentheses. So I distribute and I get 3y plus 3. I distribute over here, and I get negative 8x plus 56. Then I need to put everything that has an x or a y on the left side, so all the variable terms will go on the left side. I can accomplish that by adding 8x to both sides. On the left, I get 8x plus 3y plus 3. On the right, the 8x's cancel, and I just get 56. And the last step now is to get that 3 onto the right side by subtracting it away from both sides. So I'll have 8x plus 3y is equal to 53. And this is the form ax plus by equals c. So this is the answer.